Incarnation is our very being. It's hard to imagine a scenario where humans could survive long hibernation periods in a deep slumber lasting hundreds or even thousands of years. If we were preserved in a frozen state, for example, could we be thought out and go on to live in some capacity for a very long time? To achieve this today, we would have to be alive to begin with and in good health. Our bodies survive coma states for years but break down very easily. If it is possible for our entire being to be frozen and reanimated, it is entirely unclear if the consciousness of the person that occupies said body would survive this process. The reason we are saying this, guys, is because of a dramatic find in the permafrost of Siberia that has the scientific community the world over at a standstill. Wait to you hear this. According to University of Tennessee microbiologist Tatiana Veshnesvskaya's, as the permafrost melted away from these tiny worms, they sprang back to life after being frozen for over 40,000 years. The significance of the discovery has reverberated across the Earth. For if these tiny life forms can survive after being frozen suddenly as the extreme conditions overwhelmed the land, then maybe, just maybe, there are these types of life forms suspended in animation on other worlds across the universe. Against all the odds, these things have survived unsurvivable conditions, blowing the doors wide open on our understanding as to how life works. Researchers are discovering organisms frozen and presumed dead for millennia that can bear life anew. These Ice Age zombies range from simple bacteria to multicellular animals, and their endurance is prompting scientists to